Uh, and you can see the second part of Prisoners' Wives on Tuesday night at 9 o'clock on BBC One and BBC One HD. Uh, our gadget e uh, expert, Lucy Hedges, is here. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Good. It's, um, it's gadget roulette time. We've got yes. three gadgets here. <laughs> um, I reckon that one will work. Uh, let's have a yeah, go at the other two. Yeah, I'm a bit concerned though. about one of them this morning, but let's uh, okay, move on. Let's OK, so first up, yep. we've got the Gear 4 Unity Remote. This is a clever, discreet device designed to turn your eye thing, be it iPod Touch, iPad, iPhone, into a universal remote. Now, it works with a dedicated application that's free. So once you download it, you pair the devices via Bluetooth, and then you're presented with a selection of gadgets. Now, the app has hundreds of device uh, codes for different devices. So once you've found the model that you think belongs to your TV or your Blu-ray player, for example, you pair them up and then you're presented with this uh, mm. remote interface and you can control your devices. Right. So we've paired it up with a Blu-ray player and a fan. Okay. So we're going to give that a go. So if, I hit, if I hit play on the Blu-ray player, there we go. Yay! Yes! Yay! <laughs> High five, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> So you paired it up, so from the comfort of your iPad, you're sitting on the sofa, you can control your TV, your Blu-ray player, your DVD player, your home cinema system. It's just kind of an easy add-on, easy to use add-on for your iPhone. Though didn't you tell us a couple of weeks ago that mm -hmm. we were all going to be talking to our TVs and... Yes, that is where we're moving, voice-controlled remotes, voice-controlled TVs. So I think eventually the, the bog-standard remote will be rendered obsolete. Yeah, obsolete, yeah. But the, what, the thing about Gear 4, they're kind of utilising tablets and things we use every day you know, in the realm of remotes, so I think maybe it's not so obsolete when you're using something like an application for your okay. iPhone. Problem with all these, they get loads of gadgets and then they, they, they only have a limited shelf life, don't they? Yeah, they? yeah, there's always going to be something that supersedes it. There'll yeah. be a much super sexier model later all on. All right, sure. what about this? This is How much is that, sorry? Uh, this is £80 and okay. the application's free. Right, what about okay, these? Okay, this is these. a suit-up pair of binoculars. This is the Sony Dev 5 3Ds. So not only are they a very futuristic, cool-looking pair of binoculars, but they also shoot full HD video and 3D video as well. In fact, they're the world's first digital binoculars to do so. So on top of your 1080p video, you've got 3D now, because you're looking at them at the image through two separate channels, it gives you that stereoscopic image, which means you can get the 3D effect without needing glasses, which is what you can see now. Obviously, people at home can't see. This is some footage that we've taken uh, using the binoculars. You can see it's nice and crisp, nice and clear. You can zoom in on your subjects if you want. If you're in 2D, you can shoot from as close as one centimetre. If you're shooting in 3D, as close as 80 centimetres. Um, we've got autofocus. Sony have chucked in its image stabilisation system to ward off those shaky hands. <laughs> and, uh, I've it's got to say, cool. these are absolutely amazing to look through. They really are stunning. They're very expensive, but £2,000. £2,000. £2, <gasps> I think the technology inside it, great for avid bird watchers, stalkers maybe, wildlife <laughs> fans. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for peeking on the neighbours. Right, what's next? Okay, I like finally. That. I think this is your fave. Do you want to grab that? This yeah. makes me feel a bit weird. This is the Petron Compound Bow. Mm. Now, we're not going to shoot it in the studio for health and safety reasons. Yeah, I'm not allowed, so to, put, I'm not allowed to put yes. the arrows in. Don't, don't, don't load the, one up. There's the arrows. But we've got some VT to show it in action. So if you fire that up, we can see exactly how you use it. Now, unlike a traditional <laughs> bow... <laughs> it's going to work now. Now, unlike a traditional bow, which uses... Um, a single string and a more flexible bow. This uses a pulley system. So what this means is it reduces the amount of um, effort needed to hold the string at full draw. Shit. Poor style there, Emma. You've got to get it right back <laughs> by, your, by your ear. And... Hey. Oops. Oh. <laughs> he hasn't broken it. <laughs> Now you can adjust the draw length, the draw weight, depending on the... What's this one we've got here? There's three coming through. It comes in three models, youth, light adult and adult. This is light adult because it's for beginners. OK. So I think we should have a go when the show's over. How much are these? Uh, £60. All right, brilliant. Thanks a lot, Lucy. <laughs> uh, for more information on any of today's gadgets, just email us via our website and we'll get back to you. Uh, Liz Bullen sc uh, scours the globe in search of the most intelligent creatures and man's best friend might just be the one. This is Super Smart Animals. Thank you.